Anyway, my, you know, my dad, uh, I tell him another story, but for the new people. You know, in one year, all the longshoremen's kids were getting English racers, you know. They had really skinny tires on them, which no one had ever seen before, and they had three speeds on them. So they were like, they sounded dangerous, you know, really awesome. So all, my father knew that all the longshoremen kids were getting these bikes, and he couldn't get me one. So my father started building me a bike. He got a frame first, like an old rusty frame from down in the dumps, and he cleaned it off and spray painted it matte black, you know. Then he got some like knobby tires for it, which were not cool at the time yet. And, uh, you know, put some fenders on it, put decals all over it, flaming skull decals, you know. Uh, so it, it really looked fantastic, you know. So on the day when all the other kids got uh, these English racers, I got this bike. And, uh, you know, Christmas meant a lot to my dad, even though we were poor. It was like all oh, everybody's parents, you know, they tried to do their best for you. So uh, he got me that bike. My father died a week before Christmas, uh, in real life later on. You know, so uh, when he died, I wrote this song for him to honor him. And the song just ties together his passing a week before Christmas with the building of that bike that he did. So I wrote this story in a song that, you know, the kid's father is building this bike, but he knows he's on his last legs. He's dying. He's trying to get this bike done before Christmas so his kid has a happy Christmas. You know, uh, it's going to be kind of a bummer. So that the father in this story dies a week before Christmas, just like my dad did. And the family got together because they know the father loved Christmas. They felt obligated to try to be happy and do the gift thing together. So they did that. You know, they woke up in the morning and they shared gifts with each other. But the kid just couldn't wait to get away because he really knew he was going to lose it and he didn't want to bum everybody out. So as soon as he opened his gifts and he said, he said to his mother, I'm going out in the yard. He went out and sat at the picnic bench, one of those red wooden picnic benches that his father used to sit at out the yard. He was watching the snow come down and uh, you know, thinking of his father and, you know, he was crying. And then he noticed there was tears in it. There was this uh, old beat up looking tarp uh, over by the garage that he had never seen before. He went over to the tarp and he uh, lifted it up and shook the snow on it. Like his father had been filming for him for Christmas. And uh, that's where the story of the song starts. It's called Bike.
Yeah.